Good evening. For the last four years, the same stage supported several musical performances at the Oneida County Fair. This year, that stage is gone. So fair organizers needed to come up with something else. News Watch Coast Dakota Sheriff joins us live from Pioneer Park with more on how somebody helped piece together a solution. Dakota, good evening. Lane, a recent retirement meant the Oneida County Fair's usual stage was no longer available. I was here earlier today when this new stage was built and set up. It was donated by a Rhinelander business that wanted to help. I think we all hoop and hollered and were like so excited. Excited because many didn't think it would be possible. Everyone said there's no way I'm going to find someone to build this nice of a stage for us in that short of time. The Oneida County Fair's usual stage wasn't available this year. So fair coordinator Tom Barnett reached out to the community to see if someone could help. Steps on this end. Shenick Home Improvements answered the call. I said, yeah, I want to do it. I want to do something for the community. And this is something that fits right into our expertise. Oh, Mike Borsier offered to build a stage that the fair committee could keep. It wasn't like donate once and it's one and done. I knew this was going to be for years and years and years and I wanted to build it for years and years and years. Borsier decided to build eight eight by eight sections that are bolted together. That way it can be taken apart and stored easily and it can be easily changed. If they ever wanted to just utilize half of the stage, they could take half of the stage or if they want to rearrange the design of it. It's very maneuverable and we're going to get a lot of use out of it. Barnett was surprised by the amount of generosity Borsier has shown, but he says it gives him hope for the future of the fair. I think the community is really getting behind the fair and I think as the years go on, we're going to build more and more relationships. The fair would be willing to let people borrow or rent the stage for other events. The fair's festivities will kick off this Thursday. Live in Rhinelander, Dakota Sherrick, Newswatch 12.